Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today, I'll be discussing what is data science, different pathways to becoming a data scientist, and a word of advice to aspiring data scientists. Data science involves data and some science. The definition or the name came up in the 80s and the 90s when some professors were looking into the statistics curriculum and they thought it would be better to call it data science. But what is data science? I'd say Data scientists want to attempt to work with data to find answers to questions that they're exploring. In a nutshell, it's more about data than it's about science. If you have data and you have a curiosity and you're working with data and you're manipulating it, you're exploring it, the very exercise of going through analysing data, trying to get some answers from it, is data science. Data science is relevant today because we have tons of data available now. We should worry about a lack of data. Now we have data deluge. In the past, we didn't have algorithms, now we have algorithms. In the past, the software is expensive, now it's so open source and free. In the past, we can store a large amount of data, now, we have, now for a fraction of the cost, we can get zillions of datasets for a very low cost. So the tools to work with data, the very availability of data, and the ability to store and analyze data, it's all cheap, it's all available, it's all ubiquitous, it's all here. There's never been a better time to be a data scientist. There are so many different parts of data science. You might have a business background or a degree in mathematics or computer science. I've seen people for civil engineering background and even biomechanical background coming into data science. Almost all hard skills, expert fields and engineering fields deal with data. You see, a data scientist is a master of all than the conventional jack of all. A seasoned data scientist is good in math, computer science, has a good business acumen and possess a hacker mindset. Advice to new to aspiring data scientists, eh? Well, my advice to an aspiring data scientist is to be curious, extremely argumentative and judgmental. Curiosity is an absolute must. If you're not curious, you will not know what to do with the data. Judgmental because if you do not have preconceived notions about things, you wouldn't know where to begin with argumentative because if you can argue and if you can play the case at least you can start somewhere and then you learn from data and then modify your assumptions and hypothesis and your data would help you learn and you might start at the wrong point that's all right you may say that i thought i believed this but now with the data i know this so this allows you a learning process the other thing that a data scientist would need is some comfort and flexibility with analytics platforms some software, some computing platform, but that's secondary, you know. The most important thing is curiosity and the ability to take positions. Once you've done that, once you've analyzed, then you've got some answers. And then there's the last thing a data scientist needs, and that is the ability to tell a story. But once you have your analytics, once you have your tabulations, now you should be able to tell a great story from it. Because if you don't tell a great story for me, your findings will remain hidden, remain buried, nobody would know. But your rise to prominence is pretty much relying on your ability to tell great stories. A starting point would be to see what is your competitive advantage. Do you want to be a data scientist in any field or a specific field? Because let's say you want to be a data scientist in, uh, and work for an IT firm or web dev based, an internet based firm, then you need a different set of skills. And if you want to be a data scientist in the health industry, then you need a different set of skills. So figure out what's, what you're interested in and what is your competitive advantage. Your competitive advantage is not necessarily going to be your analytical skills. Your competitive advantage is your understanding of some aspect of life where you exceed beyond others in understanding that. Maybe it's film, maybe it's retail, maybe it's health, maybe it's computers. Once you've figured out where your expertise lies, then you start acquiring analytical skills. What platforms do you learn and those platforms, those tools will be specific to the industry in, that you're interested in. And then, once you've got some proficiency in the tools, the next thing would be to apply your skills to real problems and then tell the rest of the world what you can do with it. So, I hope you somewhat got an idea what is data science and what makes a good data scientist. I'd like to take this moment to encourage all of you to subscribe to the YouTube channel to be notified when my next video comes. And hit the like button if you found this video somewhat useful. Till next time, cheerio!